Hi, my name is Jenny Kelch. I am a Mormon Democrat. My name is Alvin. My political affiliation, I am registered Republican. Um, I met him 12 years ago. 11 years ago. A friend introduced us and we hit it off right away. Did not discuss politics. It was not part of the equation. We are both uh, opposite sides of the coin, so it keeps peace in the home by not speaking about it too much. Um, when the debates are on TV and all that, uh, we do pretty good until the oohs and ahs and the little comments start, and it starts problems. So uh, we see things differently in a lot of realms there. I'm the owner of a raised pizza and anthem. Y'all come up here and partake and I am uh, LDS. Um, it, it seems very incongruent to be Mormon and a Democrat. Um, actually, it, to me, it's the only congruency. I'm Democrat because of the gospel and because of the way Jesus Christ behaved and his caring for the poor and his intents, which is, to me, counterintuitive to what's going on these days with corporations being the center of the universe. We're out in the Old West and I like packing my guns. Government's too big, needs to be smaller, and the local guy needs to handle his own problems and political issues. My biggest issue in the election is agency, is protection of the poor, and making sure that women have the rights that they, they worked for so hard since the 50s. I will be voting for Obama, despite the fact that Romney is LDS. Voting for Mitt Romney, well, He's uh, for the businessman, uh, taxes are killing us, and uh, we need less taxes so that we can afford to hire more people, buy equipment to expand, and if we keep getting taxed, uh, we're gonna be all be out of business before long. I respect him as a human being. I think he's very conflicted about some of the things he's been asked to say and do to get into a position to be a leader. I don't know, necessarily believe that he will vote terribly right wing, but I believe he feels like he has to present himself that way. Well, I think uh, Romney has proven himself owning several businesses. I think when he took over the Salt Lake Olympics that uh, it was going under and having a lot of problems and he pulled it out and made it a profitable Olympics. I don't believe he's the best person for the job. I don't believe he is connected and understands anyone that makes, you know, in a normal salary range. I think that he is more connected with um, super PACs and corporations and the Koch brothers than he is with the, the man in the neighborhood, the general person. Um, you know, I think through his church service and history, he's learned how to deal with people and problems. And uh, as a governor, I think he's made mistakes, but he's learned from them. And I think because of his experiences in business and politics, I think he can do a much better job. My husband is a wonderful person. He's very supportive in my views. He is actually, when stood up for me in scenarios where politics was being brought up and it was making me uncomfortable. We all need to be open-minded enough to listen to the other viewpoint, agree or not agree, but be open-minded to at least listen and say, oh, I understand where they're coming from. I don't agree with it, but I understand it. 